Come on, come on, come on! Oh, God! She's... alive. Hey everyone, it's Martin here, one hour playthrough. Welcome back to this uh, let's full playthrough of a mod. Scott, I'll show you. It's really, really good. We are playing, we are playing the Nova Companion WIP mod. It's incredible. Um, <coughs> there's a lot of dialogue. It's really well done. And what I'm tend to do is going to do <coughs> the main storyline. And I will do some cut edit here and there, but then I will leave a lot of stuff in. And of course, all the dialogues that are available and that's what she will trigger herself. It's really, really good. So I hope you're going to uh, enjoy this playthrough, uh, show your support and leave a like and uh, definitely leave a comment because I always love to hear from you. Uh, let's do this. There you go. Giant roaches? What the hell? And at the side note, uh, I am playing on survival mode. Always do. If you ask me, it's the best mode in the game. So, yeah. And therefore, this is why I'm picking up all these bottles. Uh, so, let's fill them with... Um, ooh, oops. That was not what I wanted to do. The purified water. If you have never played survival, do give it a try, it's so good. Um, makes the game totally different. Really, really good. All right, let's do this. Let's get out of the vault. Ooh. I want that red roach loot. Ah, there you go. Gotcha. <laughs> And these hurt on, on this low level. What happened here? It's uh, very painful. Where is everyone? Boo. <laughs> Once I have my pit boy, I will go over the uh, perks I chose as well. Um, all with a good purpose. And the purpose is not only uh, to be able to do survival, but also um, f 
for ensuring that I will get all the dialogues that he will sometimes throw at you. And in the end you get a, um, a final perk from her where she tells you she loves you once again. That's a really good perk. It's so good. And you get a sleeping perk as well. Oh yeah. When you wake up she will actually be in bed with you. How is that for a change? So good. Alright, let's do this. Let's see. Nice. You. And you. And you. I've been um, playing this mod pretty far. I haven't finished it yet, but I'm pretty far. And um, there's so much dialogue in it. It's so very good. Most of the time, I have to say. It's... Um, Yeah, 99% of percent of the time, I would say it's very, very good. Sometimes the dialogues are a little bit odd, um, but how they manage to do this, it's incredible. It's very good. Now, what I will do is, um, since this is all about Sean, I'm going to do the main storyline and a few side quests. Also, when I go through a town like Concord or Lexington, uh, I will just visit buildings and just loot them because, of course, I need to um, upgrade and stuff as well. Uh, I, I can't go as a very low level and do everything on survival. That's uh, that's not going to happen. So, yeah. All right, let's put this on one and just for the time being on two. It's not really important. I'm not going to do a melee at all. I was thinking of making a story of this, but no. Let's put it this way, that um, both Nora and Michael, this is uh, my character's name, and they are both war veterans. And, um, they're both good at ballistic weapons, bullets. Mm -hmm. I will never forget my first time when I had this moment in the game. It's so good. All right. should be able able now we should get a quest soon this is uh, the quest to meet your spouse your missus uh, I think it's a little bit further on on the road where the quest will trigger and I will be able to bring dog meat with me as well there we go a spouse where out down there are there so let's Switch that one on. There we go. Go grab dog meat first. Got a few mods activated, but nothing like game changing. And let's see. I think I will go first in the house and get the little book. I almost level up as well. Nice. 
And then uh, I'll wait, I will um, try to prevent that Cotsworth sees me and wants to talk to me. Because I really yes. need Nora with me for that. Um, let's put this in intelligence. Alright, let me go quickly over the perks that I chose. So I've got three in strength. And the reason being is I want to be able to upgrade my armor. And I can always put points in it later. But for a starter, this is really important for me. Uh, perception 4, uh, so I can do the locksmith. One of the first skills I will uh, use. One of the first perk points I will use. And endurance, nothing really. I can use this toughness if I like. It's by default on. Charisma is going to be a very important factor actually in this one. And I will be uh, choosing this one pretty early game as well. Uh, intelligence. Um, mostly for survival, so I can get chemist, will be very early in the game, so I can make, um, what's it called, the um, antibiotics, that's right. Then agility, mostly because I'm going to use vats and a little bit of luck, so I can use a scrounger. And uh, that's basically it for perks. All right, let me go around Cotsworth. And we're going to get dog meat first. Then I will clear about everything here in Sanctuary, but I will just skip that. I will cut edit it, that out. And what I always do is I'll make a house that will most often give me like two levels and two perk points, which I will definitely going to need. And then uh, yeah, we'll take it from there. And um, I will do th at least the first quest that Preston Garvey will give me, so I can get the um, the points, the XP. It's quite a lot of XP, and if you don't do that and you go straight into the storyline, that's not really, really what I'm recommending here. All right, um, I'm going to leave some stuff behind because I only have three points in strength. My carry rate is next to nothing. I take that camera though. Okay. Bet your ass I will. I'll need that. Um, so what I will do, uh, I will leave that. I will give this to Nora. And that brings me to another point as well. Nora uses bullets, right? It's not like you give her 10 and she has enough for the whole game. No, you have to keep supplying her. And um, she will change weapons as well when one weapon has no ammo anymore. It's really cool. Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? There we go, we dinked. You wanna come with me, pal? Okay then. Alright, nice. Together. We stay here so we can take on the... Uh, oh, let me switch this off. The red roaches. Alright. And uh, scrap this. Oh, uh, I actually want to pick that up. No, pick it up. There you go, good boy. And put this in here as well for now. All right. What I notice is if you walk away from this area, the red roaches, uh, they're not red roaches. <laughs> the mole rats, I mean, they won't come back. So uh, it's a little tip for you there. You probably won't walk away, but yeah, I did have once and then I came back and wasn't able to get my XP. And I want that. Antibiotics. Ooh. I'm golden. It actually means I can delay um, the chemist. Did I get two antibiotics? Oh yeah, nice. All right, they're here. All right. Oh my dear God. Oh Jesus. <laughs> Are they done? Yeah, all right. I took quite a bit of damage. The vets went a little bit wonky. I don't know why. Um, 
I have some purified water, so let me put that on there. Did it? Hang on. Yeah, it should. There you go. Perfect. Heals like there's no tomorrow, so it's really good for survival situations. Alright. Let's fry these up. Clear a little bit of back, back space as well. And a much up. Perfect. Right, let's see, um, because I know he will be tired pretty soon. Um, let me clear this up a little bit and I'll just dump a bed in here. Yeah, I can. Nice. All right, let's sleep for at least, let's do eight hours. Perfect. We get the roll rest of bonus. Nice. All right. Let's find Nora and have a chat with her. And then uh, I'm definitely going to bring her with me. First, these bloat flies. You. And. Did he see me? No, I don't think he saw me. There he is. Yeah, got him. It's sometimes tricky to get. <laughs> All right, let's get these dogs as well. Where are they? Should be over here. Let's sneak up of them. Just. Actually fleeing from me? The other one is walking around. Yeah, the perception is not the, the best. Alright, got him. The other one. There he is. Gotcha. Alright, nice. We eat dog tonight. There she is. Let's see what she's got to say for herself. Hey there. Oh my god. It's really... It's really you. This can't be happening. This isn't happening. What happened to... The world? This whole commonwealth is a nightmare. It's a wasteland. People are barely surviving up there. Oh. This is just what I need right now. Everything here is trying to kill me. Is anyone alive? Did anyone get out? Everyone's... dead. How long have you been here? I'm not sure. I'm just doing what it takes these days. What do you think we should do? I don't know what to do. Ugh. The world's changed so much. None of this makes sense. I just want my son back. It's hopeless. I've lost him. Sean's gone. Don't worry. I'll get him back. I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. I promise. Thank you. Thanks. For sharing that with me. Family's important. I was in cryogenic storage for a long time. I only just woke up. How did you manage to escape? I was about to ask you the same thing. I got shot at pretty bad. So, I found a stem pack. Found a couple of them, actually. I only thought out recently. The bastard who shot me took my baby. I don't even have a clue who he is or where he's gone. Either way, I need to find Sean. Hey, hun. Thank you. We're in this world for the long haul. Together. Let's get out of here. Oh yeah. Ding. Boom. That's a really big advantage having her at my hey, side. Hey, sweetie. 
in survival because she can carry a shitload of stuff. <laughs> let's see what let's you trade. got. Let's trade. Um, I think I found this shotgun. I don't think I have the... I have some shells. I'll uh, give her more at uh, the moment that I have more. If you're heading out, why not come with me? Sure. Let's go. All right. Let's go. All right, what we'll do is let me quickly pick these up. Don't have to activate the Abinethi farm quest. We're probably going to go to that um, station for this guy to get the locket. But uh, we'll see about that. First, let's get back to Sanctuary. Because I need to... Uh, Get some more skill points before I head out. Um, I want to have the hacking. Uh, I have two skill points actually to spend right now. So let's see. Um, what I really, really, really need is this one. I'm not going to do much in it, but I really, really need it. So take that one and I will take that one. And soon I will be doing the uh, the chemist um, I'll also be doing local leader because I will do some supply runs uh, because eventually hangman's alley that probably will be my base of operations and I want to have all the resources available to me so I don't have to run back and forth because as you probably know there is no fast travel in survival uh, which is sometimes a bummer but at the other hand uh, I really do like that. I can appreciate it. All right. This is of one of the only places that my FPS starts dropping. And actually, I might be able to show you. Um, I think there's a whole bunch of water underneath here and they didn't clear it up. All right, I'll take these on uh, later. What I'm going to do is I'm going to clear up Sanctuary. I just do that off camera. Let's uh, let's talk to Cothworth first. Yeah, yeah, let's do that first. And then um, I will continue recording. But uh, yeah, let's let's have a word with him and see how the responses are. As I live and breathe. Oh, it's, it's really you. Cothworth? You're still here. So, other people could still be alive, too. Well, of course I'm still here. Surely you don't think a little radiation could deter the pride of General Atomics International? <laughs> but you seem the worse for wear. Best not let the wife see you in that state. Hmm? Where is the missus, by the way? Hmm. What do you think, hon? Codsworth, I, I can't believe you're still here. You're looking good for a robot that survived an atomic war. Oh my, is that... Mom? Forgive me, Mom. I feel a wave of nostalgia coming on. Sir, Mom, it's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? God damn them. You're shaking a little there. Are you ill, Mum? Codsworth, listen to me carefully. Have you seen him? Have you seen Sean? Why, the, the missus had him last, remember? Oh, perhaps she's gone to the Parker residence to arrange a play date. I'm sure she'll be back with him momentarily. Sean's been kidnapped. But I'm going to find him. I'm going to get my son back. It's worse than I thought. Hmm? You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> It doesn't matter how long it's been. I feel fine. 200 years? What? Are you sure? Uh, uh, 
bit over 210, actually, sir. Or give and take a little for the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack? <laughs> you must be famished. Codsworth, you're acting... a little bit weird. What's wrong? I... I... Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets out nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> nothing! And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house <laughs> and the car. The car! How do you polish rust? Stay with me, pal. Focus. Uh, I'm afraid I don't know anything, sir. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were... dead. I did find this hollow tape. I, I believe the missus was going to present it to you as a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. Thank you, Codsworth. You're, you're welcome. Now, enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? Sean may turn up yet. All right. Lead the way. Proud to serve, sir. All right, guys. I will leave you here for episode one of the Nora... Uh, yeah, play through, and then eventually a review of this mod. But it's going to take a be it's going to be a long one. So um, do show your support and leave a comment. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. And every time I upload a video, you'll get a notification of it. Um, I'm tending to upload two or three episodes of a Fallout for in a week. So uh, yeah, hope you're going to like it. It's going to be really good. It's a really, really great mod. Try it yourself or wait and see my videos and then maybe you try it yourself. All right, but for now, thanks for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.